Hey, Flutter just dropped a sweet preview update for Hot Reload in web. Uh, this is uh, exciting news for me. I do a lot of stuff in Flutter web, so um, let's check it out. Uh, first thing you want to do is make sure you're on the main channel or change to the main channel. You shouldn't be on the main channel normally. Um, you know, it's kind of a bit more experimental as opposed to the stable channel. So just do a Flutter channel main. Then you'll want to run the Flutter upgrade. This will make sure you have the latest on main. Uh, then uh, we will create a Flutter project. So I'm just going to go to a good place to do it. And um, we will call this, uh, we'll do Flutter create hot reload. Um, now you can just in your terminal run flutter run uh, So we can just do flutter run and uh, we can put in this flag web experimental hot reload and um, Although sorry one thing I want to do is of course choose which um, Target so we'll do dash D Chrome and now we're up and running here, and this is fine. Um, however um Using the hot reload when you are just running through terminal does require you to actually hit uh, the R key, the lowercase R key, in order to do the hot reload or uppercase to do the normal hot restart like we used to only have in web. Um, the better way to do this, though, so that we can have it integrated when we just save a file is go to our uh, launch.json and we're going to create a launch.json file. We're going to choose Dart and Flutter. And what we're going to do is um, add a new configuration or just replace the ones that you have. Um, with one, the main difference is that we want to make sure it just targets Chrome so that we don't uh, try this in, in Mac. It doesn't make sense. Uh, but we want to add the flag that we did here. So uh, web experimental hot reload. Now we'll be able to click the green button here for this configuration. OK, it's up and running. So let's uh, test this out. Let's go to our main.dart. And uh, let's just change something about it. Uh, let's change its color to um, orange. We'll save that. So you see it changed to orange. And uh, just to prove that, you know, it's not just a really fast hot restart, we'll actually change the state here of something and go to red. And we'll see that the state will remain, the color changed. Uh, red and orange are pretty close together. So let's actually make it blue. There we go. Uh, so yeah, this is great. Um, check it out. And uh, my goal now is to update some projects to get closer to this so that uh, I can start using this in some of my Flutter web projects.